Jim Leahy with news and announcements for St. John and Batesville, Kansas, on cable channel 3 and sandylandcenter.org. Today is Wednesday, the 24th of June. It's 89 here in the square in St. John at noontime. <clears throat> and we're looking for a sunny, windy day with a high temperature of 96. And tomorrow will be a little warmer, partly cloudy. Tomorrow, 97, the high temperature. Then on Friday, we are predicted to have morning thunderstorms and uh, 87 the high temperature with a 50% chance of rain. <clears throat> then uh, Saturday, Sunday, and Monday are all going to be sunny. And 87 the high temperature Saturday, 92 on Sunday, and 94 on Monday. So we'll have a brief couple of days in the 80s on Friday and Saturday. <clears throat> Well, we have an anniversary this this session, and Jack and Bob Ed Davis, happy anniversary today. We hope that you really enjoy your anniversary. It's kind of a nice day, a little windy, but it's a good day for an anniversary. And uh, those are the temperatures and birthdays and anniversaries. Now, uh, just a, a word. Uh, it's a good thing to have a city paper of the St. John News, and I think it's a good thing to have a television station that we can do the news as well. And we would like for everyone to check the St. John News, and our uh, regrets and our wishes for good things go out to Shane Steinmetz, the county commissioner, uh, they had a fire Monday at his house and it burned down and there's an article in the St. John News and a picture of that. So all of our best wishes are to Shane Steinmetz with that real tragedy that came by surprise for him and his family. And we're glad that no one was injured, but it is a shame to see a house that burns down in the city. Uh, well, we go on. We don't have a lot of news because we're getting to the end of the month. <coughs> the Dodge City Casino is the only thing left, and that's on June 30th, which is next Tuesday. And uh, they leave at uh, 8 in the morning, <coughs> and you can go to the mall as well. And uh, they leave the casino at 2, and they're home by 3.30, and the fee is $10. And of course, we have to watch out for the wind and the temperature, because uh, both are apt to be too much uh, for the city bus to be safe in such a long trip uh, with many senior citizens in it. Well, we come to our menus. And today at the Sunflowers, for lunch, they're having chicken strips, fried potatoes, and coleslaw. Uh, Thursday, they're having lemon pepper fish, rice pilaf, and garden salad. And on Friday, they're having beef stew with a cracker packet and cardinal salad. I don't know what a cardinal salad is. Now, for the VIP Center in Maxville, they have a choice today, ham and beans or stew. And a tossed salad with cornbread. Then uh, on uh, Thursday, they're having grilled chicken, sweet potatoes, and fries and corn. And on Friday, barbecued beef, potato salad, and copper penny salad. That's another salad. I don't know what that is like. So, that's the news and announcements that we have. <clears throat> the word of the day is uh, one of our favorite ones. Happiness can't be measured by somebody's wealth. For, for instance, a person with $8 million 
may not be one bit happier than a person with only seven million. This is Jim Lecky, hoping you have a great Wednesday and rest of the week.